right now it's 6 30 and today is the day we're going back to sri lanka going back home and it feels both really good and really weird we've been in bali now for two months so we're just gonna make a cup of coffee and some breakfast and then we're on the way to the airport we have a lot of big bags that we have to carry so i'm a little bit scared it's gonna be exciting to see how that goes i think satin is trying to take some of the bags down right now <laughs> Okay, so this is how our baggage is looking right now. It's a little bit crazy. This is so heavy. Satin is carrying this and then I am walking with this other one with all the boards. Ready to go. Okay, now we're waiting for checking into the gate and Satin is sick again. I don't know what it is with traveling and being sick, but I'm not sick yet. So fingers crossed, I keep it. And we have the big bags over here. I feel like I'm gonna be nervous the whole time until we actually see the bolt. Yes. Oh, we're also bringing a bolt for a friend who bought a bolt, and like we're really scared that something's yes. gonna happen. But hopefully, everything goes smooth. in one piece we arrived late last night at like two in the night and the first thing we did was just to take the surfboard bags because i've just been so 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 scared about them coming home in one piece and obviously like we also checked in the airport that everything looked fine but we couldn't unwrap them and stuff like that so now we know that everything is perfect and i'm just so happy and grateful that it is everything actually went really perfect in the airport our bags came right away and it was super smooth and easy so actually everything went really good and as you can see it's kind of a mess behind me here but i'm just gonna clean up a little bit right now today we've just been doing some practical things and then we have been visiting sachin's family and it was so nice to see them again um so that was just really nice and right now Sachin has just left to go out and surf with his friends this is his last day off before he starts work again he starts early tomorrow morning so today we're just gonna chill a bit now we got everything done and then we're gonna chill and go to bed not too late i think we also just went grocery shopping and i thought that i wanted to show you guys what we bought we didn't buy a lot but we just bought some things that we needed you guys can see we just packed out a little bit it's still a little bit messy here but yeah i'm trying to get everything out of the luggage and the blanket is also getting some air out here it's so nice to be back in Sri Lanka. I actually miss it a lot. First, I wanted to show you guys what we picked up today. And we are obviously trying to be on a budget a little bit because we've been spending a lot of money in Bali. So we took the spices with us. And also we have some coffee left. So that's actually from Bali, but we still have it here. And then, first of all, we bought some tissue paper, just so we have some paper. Sachin is also really sick right now, actually, so he needs some paper for his nose. And these were on a discount. It's oats, and I think we'll be eating oats for breakfast for the next month, just because it's pretty cheap and easy. Actually, I bought two just because they were on a discount. We also had to grab Sachin's favorite conditioner. Now his hair is not so long, so he's actually not really using it. So this one is just for me. Okay, now there's just a train in the background. I don't know if you guys can hear it. But in the grocery store, there was just a lot of discount on a lot of things, actually. So 
most of the things we bought had at least 20% discount which was perfect in our situation right now we also bought two milks and now it's done with the oat milk i don't know let me know if you know any place in sri lanka where they have oat milk i'm sure that they have it somewhere but in this area in Veligame, i just haven't found it so right now it's going to be this milk until we find some oat milk somewhere Sachin is always making the craziest looks. We also bought a hand soap. Then we bought some soap to fill it up with. This is like our favorite scent with cucumber. I don't know, it's really good. And it's more cheap to buy it this way and then fill the other one up when it's empty. And then we also bought these soap pods with the same scent also on discount and then a lot of noodles you guys know at this point and it's kind of embarrassing but you know we have to eat on a budget this month so it's going to be noodles for lunch i guess most days i also had a discount like for three and i don't know we saw some of these with a new packaging or maybe they made a new design or something it looked like that and then there's still all of these for a cheaper price we bought like three of these packages with three and of course we also bought two big waters that's actually everything we bought i'm sure we're gonna need some other things but that's just the things that we grabbed and as i said we're trying to live a little bit more cheap this month so we'll see how that goes now i just spent some time cleaning up and unpacking so i have a calm environment to do my study in i guess i'm gonna do some study for a couple of hours now Sachin is also out surfing so i have some time where i can just study and also these are the shorts that i bought in that secondhand market flea market and i don't know i feel like they're really cute just for like wearing at home with something comfy so now i think i'm gonna make myself a coffee and then i'm gonna sit in my comfy clothes and try to get some homework done okay now we've been home and back in sri lanka more than one week how does it feel this feel also i miss the body because they have really good weight yeah. but fine now is everything's gonna be really normal again <laughs> yeah it's also good to be home right yes we are not thinking so much yeah it's really nice and calm to get back into the routine and you also started working again yes that's the good things <laughs> yeah that's cool and we're actually staying right now at the same place as we stayed before it's still kind of the rain season right yes it's like about to get seasoned but these two days has been really sunny so now we're gonna go out to buy some vegetables and fruit and fruit yeah okay and then we'll see i have school later today so We've just been having a chill morning. You don't have to work today. Uh, today is a little bit bigger waves. I think that people will be scared to go to the lineup. Yes, so that's then why. Then means my holiday. I'm also scared. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good for me. Waves gonna be bigger. I need to holiday because I can surf. Yes. <laughs> so when I'm doing school, you're gonna surf. But okay. now, yes. Let's go. Oh yeah. Nice sunglasses. <laughs> We're currently still in the mosquito and it definitely needs a touch up. <laughs> it has seen better days, but that will be next month. <laughs> back home again and we both went to the grocery store to buy a couple of things and then we also went to buy some vegetables so i'm just going to show you guys what we bought this time today we brought our tote bag so we didn't have to get so many small plastic bags the first thing that we bought was this salad then we also found these mushrooms that we wanted to try i think Sachin's gonna cook something fancy with those I want to try to make ginger shots, so we bought some ginger. Oops, 
and I've never tried it before so that's gonna be funny we do have a blender so I'm gonna try because of that we also bought some lemon and honestly this looks like lime if you ask me but this is apparently the lemon here in Sri Lanka that's the only one we could find anyways <laughs> and then we bought two and a half kilo avocados I don't even know if I can show you like this no, I guess I can't, but there's so many and they're not completely ripe yet, but we're just gonna wait around until they're ready. And now we have a lot, so that's so delicious. Then we also bought a lot of bananas and for this we needed another bag, but they just looks like this. And I think we're gonna freeze some of them down for smoothies and the rest we're just gonna snack on and use for breakfast. In the grocery store, I bought this apple juice just because I think that you can put it into the ginger shots and then it might taste a little bit bitter. As I said, it's my first time, so I'm just trying something out. So we're going to try to put this in them. I also bought two milk because they were on discount. So I always need that for coffee. And then we also make oatmeal in the morning with milk. So we needed those and then in the end i bought these milo for one of my friends in denmark so i just bought like this package she really loves these so i'm gonna bring them home once i visit home it's gonna be a long time but now i have them ready and now i actually thought about getting cleaned up a bit here i don't know if you can see but it's a mess in the kitchen First, I'm gonna clean up these things and then I'm gonna try to organize over here. Gretchen has been cleaning those coffee jars, so now you can basically use them as iced coffee glasses or storage i think we're going to use the big ones for storage and the big bottle over here i'm going to try to use for the ginger shots and then there's this ball that i absolutely love for smoothies or rice balls so i'm going to try to organize a little bit because as you can see over here we have a lot of things this area is actually fine. That's just the glasses and then some of the jars we already have from the coffee. And you can see that we just use these and then take away the packaging and then they're just perfect for coffee and iced coffee cups. But I just want to clean up this area a little bit. And then I want to put like the sugar, for example, in one of the big jars. So now I'm going to do that. Now I just try to clean up this area a little bit and I think that it looks much better. I'm not like the biggest fan of this green thing but we have like a mixture of our things and then the things they have here in the home that we rent and I think that looks much better now. We try to put some of the things in these jars so we have coffee milk powder for tea sugar and then oats and then i have this cute little snacks where we actually have some small papadums inside then we have some spices and this one one of my best friends gifted me to put salt in so cute she made this herself and then we have our glasses and pots and pans and then our blender and some tea and then i just put the avocados over here so they can get ready close to our onion and garlic so that's it